WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of what is right now uh, kind of uh, kind of so-so. It's a bit cloudy. We've got a bit of storms that are going to be brewing out here over the next couple of days. But right now, there's a storm in the marketplace, and that's taking U.S. indices high. You've got all the U.S. indices treading the upside, with the exception being the Wilshire 5000. But the Dow's up 381. The S&P's up 32. That's one-tenth, uh, a little over 1%, one and a quarter percent almost, and eight-tenths. NASDAQ's up 1% at 111. Six-tenths for the Russell. That's 11 points. Semis are up 2.5%, 61 points there. Gold is up over 2%, 2 and a quarter percent, up 37 bucks. That's on fire. Silver's on fire as well, 3% to the upside. 65 cents. She's trading out of 21.57. Lights recruit is off 28 pennies. Natural gas off 70 cents. That's down at 6.24. The 30 year treasury up one point and seven ticks. She's trading out at 119.23. Let's figure out what all that means by take a look at our nine panel market update chart. In the upper left hand side, we'll see the ES mini. Right now, trading into the top of the weekly profile, that's up at the 38.38 level. Pricing close above that, you shouldn't see a run for the top of that profile, 38.97. That's especially true with that spot volatility being below its 50-day exponential moving average. The 50-day is at 27.52. The spot trading out at 24.35. NASDAQ, much weaker than the S&P 500. Uh, it is just consolidating with inside its daily profile. It did find support at the bottom of that weekly profile a couple of days ago. That was the test there. Price should go target the 11,235 area. U.S. dollar index right now is trading below the bottom of its daily profile. The level that you're going to want to watch there was priced out at... Give me a moment. Uh, 109.81. Now, the next level of support before this could signal a potential A to B equals CD down pattern, the level to be watching 109.36. That is the low from the trading day of October 27th. Gold is taking up. It is now trading above the top of its daily profile. That's at 16.82. That would suggest a run to its recent highs. That's back on October 4th. That highs at 17.38. I would say if gold clears 17.38, 17.79 is where you'd set your sights. In the case of silver nice a to b equal cd pattern uh, it is a strong move out here off of that c point this suggests the next price target at 2209 the 1.618 c to d expansion level light three crude just dealing with resistance out here that resistance being the top of its daily and weekly profiles those are at 9158 and 9094 natural gas getting back inside now it's a new profile that is formed here and the support level, and this is where price might be pulling back to, is the 571 to 588 area. And the 30-year Treasury, although it's got a nice, um, having a nice rally today, still below profile levels. Its resistance area, 121 and a quarter. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Zed Show. But if you have to start your Tuesday, please have a terrific one and go out there and vote. We'll see you soon. Take care. The